Hi guys and welcome to my <laughs> come watch me vlog day 26 and I've like missed so many days so it's a complete fail <laughs> for me to vlog every day. Um, today's vlog I wanted to talk about Lust Habit. So I've just received my Lust Habit box, I did yesterday and um, yeah I would just like to talk about it. So I've been subscribed to Lust Habit for at least a year. I was also a Glossy Box member and then Glossy Box, as everybody knows, handed everything over to Lust Habit. Now, <clears throat> there was a point where I was going to actually unsubscribe from Lust Habit because I just wasn't really happy with the products that I was getting and I just, yeah, I just didn't enjoy it as much as Glossy Box. I decided to stay with it once Glossy Box said they were going to um, hand it all over. So the first couple of boxes that I got were really, really good and I was very impressed with Lust Habit and I even said in my videos, wow, I'm really impressed by Lust Habit. Now that everything seems to be calming down and everybody swapped over from Glossy Box, all the membership stuff's done, your credit card stuff's been done, I... I personally received this so just a box just with some products shoved in there nothing special nothing pretty about it a little bit of cheap ass paper with some random bits of red that's what I got in my box now I haven't watched anybody's videos for last have it this month I just haven't done it I just wasn't interested in watching those videos okay so I am actually aware that the collector's box isn't in we didn't receive it because you know they couldn't fit it in or whatever but still like you could have yeah just presented a little bit better is all I'm saying um I am so disappointed in this lust habit that I have unsubscribed I haven't unsubscribed just yet, but as soon as I do this video, I'm unsubscribing. I'm not happy. Um, now, my best friend also receives Lust Habit, and um, she is uh, around the same age as me, so I'm 29, and she's she's black, I'm white. And the thing is, Lust Habit seems to just bunch us into this category of we're the same you get the same products. And I really, really hate that about Lust Have It. I always have hated it about Lust Have It. And it's something that I have complained about before to other people. And I've also complained to them about it. And I actually know that my friend has also complained about it too, to them. And when I say complain, we weren't like, oh, this is crap, blah, 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 fake and gay troll stuff. It wasn't like, it wasn't like that. It was like, Wow, um, here's a suggestion. How about bringing in the system that Glossy Box had where you go through and you pick your skin type, you pick how old you are, um, and all those other things that are individual to yourself, so you are receiving products that you can actually use. I mean, you you are paying for this box every month. And if, and if you can't use half of the products, what's the point? Like, really, what is the point? I would rather just go out and buy these products in my right shade in the right color that would suit me um, for my right skin type so I really get an understanding of the product and the company that's supplying the product so that's one thing and we got just for the record we got ignored um, didn't hear a reply for them didn't hear nothing so I don't know but I know that she was really disappointed in her box this month and I was like well that can happen I've been happy with my boxes um, but this one I'm not happy with so I don't like how it was presented to me and another thing is I didn't even receive all of my five products I really didn't I received four products and yeah I didn't even receive five products so I'm, I'm going to message them as well I'm gonna post this video on their Facebook page and they can see 
what's in my box. And another thing is, I think it was December, I was also missing an, a product out of that box as well. And I think everybody was. And it was like, oh, January will come and, and you will receive this product as well. I personally never actually received my fifth product from the December box. I'm pretty sure it's December. Uh, you know what, the months are hazy to me, but you know, I definitely know that I didn't receive all of the products in one of the boxes. It was promised and I still didn't receive it. I don't know if anybody else received that extra product within their, their following month or not. I don't know, but I certainly didn't. And that's something that really bugged me too. So it's twice now that this has happened. So it's just, yeah, something that bugged me. So the first thing I'm going to pull out is the little card tells you all the products that you get. I received this hand mask. So, and excuse my nails, I need, I need to remove this nail polish in a minute. Um, I received the hand mask. I don't particularly need a hand mask. I use a hand cream every day. I use a Clarins hand and nail cream and my hands are really, really soft and I don't ever have problems with my hands. So, um, it'll be interesting to try. I'm not sure what it's going to do for my skin, but um, I don't have a problem with this product or receiving this product. It's something that I've never tried before, so I am actually happy to try this one. Um, I know the company and I'm familiar with some of their products, so that's great. You get one pair and it's um, I'm guessing it's just gloves that you put on. So, you know, I'm, I'm happy to try this. This one I'm not not really happy with this is the is it the summer tan um here it is here so and as you can see hopefully my camera will focus in it's dark so i don't really think this is going to be suited to me i've got fair skin um, I'm not sure, like, when I open it up, it's very dark. I'm guessing this, I'm not sure, I mean, I'm not familiar on the whole tanning thing. I don't tan, I don't tan in the sun. I try and stay out of the sun as much as I can because I just, I, I don't want it to damage my skin. So, um, I try and stay out of the sun. I'm not a tanner at home. I just don't feel the need for it. Um... I'll give this one a go and I'm actually going to try it on the top of my leg where no one can actually see it just to see how it goes because it's so dark um is it meant to be that dark for my skin or is it for um a darker woman I don't know um but I, when I saw it and I was like dark self action tan I was just like wow okay maybe it's not that dark but anyway and then when I saw it, I thought, whoa, that's really dark. That's like, I'm going to be black. But I don't know. I haven't tried it, but I will definitely try it. And I'm going to try it on my leg. And hey, it might be the perfect color for me. I don't know. But again, if you're, if, if my friend Clancy received this product, she's black, it would do nothing for her. Like she obviously doesn't need a tan anyway. Um, so she doesn't need a tanner. That's a wasted product for her. It's it's a full amount. It's 250 mils. So it's a big you know, size, she would just have to call a loss and give it to a friend or something. So I got that one. The next product I got was the nail polish. So the natural source. So here we go. I got that one. So I got that. I haven't even opened it yet as you can see it's like a dark brown color don't know if you can see that probably something that I won't use I don't really use I don't I haven't I haven't even got any dark brown nail polish so let me just check it's camouflage nail camouflage color nail It actually says, <laughs> it's from the sand and horsetail plant. 
they they provide intense and long-lasting color to your nails without the use of potentially harming harmful synthetic okay okay so it's just a nail polish um, it's in brown I will probably use this maybe once to try it. I might try it on my toes I might use it for winter but I don't necessarily use these colors for nail polish I'm more of a pink and red and blue and purple girl <laughs> I just like my nail polishes to be light and vibrant and the last product that I received so I only received four products and as you can see my box is empty there's nothing left in here I looked all through it I thought maybe I had missed it but no I just didn't receive it and that's the lipstick and it's the L3 timeless lipstick so there it is there so it's just in the little tube and it's full size and the, I got the color jewels which when I first saw it, I was like whoa that's dark so as you can see it's it's like a really dark purple color um, I'm not sure if I would use it I'm, I mean I might use it I'm gonna swatch it here as you can see it's a very it's like a plum color um, I might use it I, I, I would probably use it and really dab it off so it's like just very lightly on my lips I don't I've got very weird shaped lips they come right down in here so if I wear a dark lipstick it just it, it looks very funny on my lips so it doesn't smell it's got a it's got a beautiful sparkle it's got a pink to it so I I like that it's definitely something that I will try um, not something that I would actually go out and buy because I like to rhyme today <laughs> so they're the products that I had received actually I'll, sh I'll show you that as well there we go so I've never tried this brand before which is good because hey like I'm trying to look for the positive things here in this lust have it so um, always interested in trying new brands to see if they gel with me nicely so they're the products that I received so only four products and I'm guessing I'm missing the moisturizing cream so I don't know if other people receive that what's that like I don't get to try it um, which is actually probably the most expensive thing on this and I didn't receive <laughs> not that that's I'm probably gonna edit that out because people will be like eh, what you want it because it's so expensive nah. no it's just I'm saying like retail price is 60 bucks whereas I got a nail polish um, you know or a face mask that's worth five bucks like anyways um, <clears throat> that's my last habit for this month my last month I'm going to be looking for another beauty box I think I'm just not happy with lust have it unfortunately it just didn't work out I'm sorry it's not you I, I, I was gonna say it's not you it's me but no it's you it's not me um so yeah <laughs> that's my honest opinion and yeah that's pretty much it guys that's all I really wanted to say um and you know what go check out lust have it for yourself because everybody is different what doesn't work for me will work for you what works for you won't necessarily work for me so it's all trying and um experimenting and you know i can imagine there are people out there that love their lust have it that just oh it's perfect for them unfortunately it's not perfect for me so that's it okay guys um that's my vlog for today and my last habit for this month <laughs> okay well, thanks for watching and i will see you tomorrow hopefully i'm gonna try so hard i really really am thanks for watching bye